Rapist and murderer Tabu Besta made some serious allegations during his last court appearance, apart from asking for a death sentence. Besta claimed he was being treated unfairly behind bars. He alleges political interference in his case. Silindelo Masikane, our senior reporter, is today speaking to correctional services officials to fact check these claims. Let's find out more. She joins us live now. Sli, uh, good morning to you. During Besta's last court appearance, some drama. But the question is, was it just that dramatics or is there truth to these allegations? Good morning, Sli. Well, that's exactly what we're here to find out. Last week's court appearance by Tabo Besta and his co-accused uh, was certainly not short of any drama and uh, many serious accusations being made uh, by Tabo Besta after his latest legal team withdrew from the matter. Uh, he says that uh, he's receiving, in essence, special treatment from correctional services, uh, which was resulting in him not being able to consult with his lawyers uh, freely, saying that uh, he's being treated uh, badly inside prison, that uh, he's not allowed outside of his cell. Uh, and of course, we're now going to give correctional services an opportunity to respond uh, to those allegations. I am joined by spokesperson uh, for DCS, uh, Mr. Singaba Kungumalo. Thank you so much uh, for your time this morning. Let's just start perhaps uh, with the issue around where Tabo Besta is being held. Uh, it is a maximum security prison. Uh, he alleges that uh, he is receiving special treatment. He's not allowed um, out of his cell. Perhaps clarify exactly what kind of an inmate Besta is classified under and what conditions um, he is perhaps living in. <laughs> 